QVS beat RKS 10 points to 6. Now we're about to witness the under 15 uh, uh, final match between Morris Brothers High School and Queen Victoria School. As you can see now, both teams making their way in uh, to the ground here at Low Valley. Just uh, quickly looking at the team list uh, uh, here, they, the Queen Victoria School uh, playing prop Josiah Nakora, Sakeo Erhuka, Ratu Isikeli, Nawatambu, Samuela Rana, Ranadika, Kayaba Ramanga, Ra, Ramanga rather, Solomone and Penny at flankers, uh, Revoni, who is the captain, playing at number eight. At halfback, uh, Madiu Rayala, at fly half, Samuela, Waisea on uh, blind side wing, Amini, Amini Sitai at inside centre, Leweni at outside centre, Ratu Kuli Niasi at wing and pullback, Michael S. Longan in Dangondang. Looking at the uh, team list for the Maris Brothers High School, the uh, under 15 team here, playing at prop, Elia Versoni, Lino at Puka, Selvin Cassidy at prop, Bryce Pickering and Aminiasi playing at locks. On the side of the squad, we ha uh, have Alberetti and Edwin and Marie. Samuel Evolo Muri at number 8, playing at halfback, Jerome Nale, Jerome Nale rather, Felipe at fly half, Paula Toca at left wing, Osea at inside center, at playing at outside center is Jason Yukonda, George Vesoni at wing, and fullback Salesitino Ravu Tau Manda. As we, we can see here on your screens the uh, supporters out here in numbers supporting their teams as we about to witness uh, the under 15 Coca Cola Zero Deans. 2015 final between Morris Brothers High School and QVS. Looking at the Morris Brothers High School uh, boys from Flagstaff playing the left to right and QVS playing from right to left. As we await Felipe Marayawa to kick off this match. Not a great kick, but is it made 10? Yes, but knock on by the QVS uh, boys. Morris Brothers with possession inside QVS's half. Taken up there by the boys from Flagstaff. Jerome bring it up. Taken up and a knock on there by Morris Brothers High School. QVS with possession. No, said the referee. Knock on by Morris Brothers High School. QVS backing it down for the first scrum in this match. So looking at that replay as Jerome played it. And that's a knock on there. Yes, by flanker Aliberetti Verevan. Set piece play there by the boys uh, from Bulini 2. But a knock on there by QVS. Two knock ons early in this match. As we see Marist back it down for a scrum right on the halfway mark. Yes, Simone, the boy from Taylor will taking it forward there. Marist with possession. Bit scrappy play here, but QVS taking the ball up. Yes, QVS with possession. As we can see, Kayava who's taking it up. Boys from Vulini 2 taking play inside QVS's half, uh, Maris Brothers' half, rather. Full kick down play. Yes, taking play in the 32. Ball being taken up by Paulo Toca. Maris Brothers. Clearing kick there by Felipe Mariawa. Taken in well by Michael. Michael with QVS taking that ball up. Great run there by Michael. Still with possession. QVS inside Marius Brothers 22. Now a great take there by the pro, uh, by the hooker rather Sakio. Half back. Great message of play here by QVS. Solomon taking that ball up. Still QVS with possession. Very passage of play being shown here by QVS, maintaining possession. Rather, not a very good pass there by Madiu, but still possession with QVS. 
running to your own men. But yes, that was an accidental uh, running into your own men by the boys uh, from Bully 2. Bit of wet conditions here at the ANZ National Stadium. A slight breeze coming in from the Nasese area. But hasn't dampened the spirits of the supporters still uh, coming in in numbers to support uh, their teams here at the Coca-Cola Zero Deans 2015 Finals. Maris with possession, clipped there by Jerome. Clearing kick by Felipe Mariawa. Good kick there by Felipe Mariawa, taking play outside the 22. Now QVS with a great attacking opportunity here. Five meters away from the Maris Brothers 22 line. Will give us with possession. Sakyo Turukawa and Delay to throw it into the line. Not a good throw. He over overthrew that. Yes, still uh, now Maris with possession. Created by Jerome. Clearing kick by Felipe Mariawa. Taken in at the back by Michael of QVS. Quick down, kick downfield there by Michael. Covering well is Celestino of Maris Brothers High School. He decides to take the ball up. Still uh, Maris with possession. They decide, finally decided to clear it away from their 22 line. Still a uh, game played here inside the Maris half. Very good play uh, as we can see the boys from Vuli 2 setting the pace in this game. It's interesting to note uh, playing here for Maris Brothers High School is Simone Rogoyumuri uh, from the village of Daku in Tailevu. This is the younger brother of the prop uh, Chosua Rogoyumuri who, is, uh, who plays prop uh, for the Maris Brothers Dream Team. They'll be playing here this afternoon, the under-18 under team. That's the young, uh, this gentleman is the younger brother of Chosua Rogoyumuri. He's playing number eight here for Maris. Mari still with possession. Jerome Nale to fit it into the scrum. Jerome clearing it out to Felipe. They decide to run it out from their inside their half. A good take there by Celestino. Celestino with possession. A good run there by Maris Brothers High School. Look at this boy run. He's taking possession inside uh, QVS's half. There was great play there, but but yes, the referee has penalized QVS. It looks like a high tackle there by the boys from Vuluri uh, 2. Yes, a high tackle it is uh, from boys from QVS. But a good passage of plays. We, we saw Salesitino Ravuta Umanda taking that ball up right from inside their 22 and taking play uh, uh, inside uh, QVS's half. There was a great passage of play there by the boys uh, from Flagstaff. Looking at that shift bay, look at look at that inside pass. Look at that run. He he took that at pace, and and he uh, there was there was some lazy tackling by the boys from Vuluni too. But look at this boy, Salesitino Ravuto Manda, uh, uh, setting the pace right there from for the boys for from Flagstaff. Right. Still, uh, Maris with possession. Lino Basuinandi to throw it into the line. Not a good throw there by, you know, still Martin sweet possession. Looks like there was, yes, it is. Not a straight throw uh, by Lino Vasuinandi. What a wasted possession there by the by uh, Maris Brothers uh, boys. Giving possession back uh, to QVS. Yes, 10 meters away from the QVS try line. See Madhu clearing that ball. Well, that's Samuel Atamani rather. Clearing kick, taking play. Ten, minute, ten meters still inside the half. Now oh, Maris Brothers High School with the rest. Oh, and knock on there by their center, Jason Iaconba. Still advantage being played here by the referee. QVS with possession. Yes, QVS taking, taking ball, ball up. A clearing kick there by Madhu Rayala. Taken in well by Celestino. Now look at this boy run. 
Celeste is still, still with possession. He steps off the right foot. He beats the QVS players. Now still Maris Brothers. Yes, the towering run here by the flanker, Oliveretti Verivalu. Still possession with Maris Brothers High School. They decided to spray it out with another great pass there by Jason Iokomba. But a good attacking opportunity now for QVS. QVS with possession, taking play inside, eight meters inside the uh, Maris Brothers half. Still QVS with possession. Yes, a great run here uh, by Samuel Rai Radadikara. Taking play now outside to their speedster, Ratu Kulinyasi. Kulinyasi. No, should have hold on, held on to possession. Now he's uh, turned possession over to the boys uh, from Flagstaff. Curing kick, box kick there by the boys uh, from Maris Brothers High School. A good take, and that was a good uh, chase there uh, by Aminiasi Kirishaw, who took that ball up. Now still Maris with possession, and a penalty now. Awarded, yes, not on your feet. The boys from QVS were not on their feet, now penalized uh, uh, for that. Look at the uh, bench, uh, the reserves for Morris Brothers High School. They were happy with that penalty being awarded to their teammates. Early into this match, we, 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 we saw the, the talent by this uh, gentleman who is playing fullback uh, for Morris Brothers, uh, Celestino Ravuatomanda. Very good play here by the boys from Marist. Five uh, meters inside the uh, QVS is 22. We have Lino Vasunandi. He needs to throw this ball in as they have a good attacking opportunity. Good throw. They're in still Marist with possession. QVS with a driving tackle there. He can drive by the boys. Uh, from Marist, taken up there uh, by Simon Rogoimuri. He can drive still uh, 10 meters away from the try line. Now the boys from Marist still with possession. Penalty now well, seems like a professional foul here. But we'll see what the referee has decided. He has awarded Maris Brothers with a penalty. He's calling up. He's calling up the captain. He's, he's giving a warning to the captain. The captain for QVS, number eight, Revoni Naduva. The gentleman from Korotongonandora is the captain for uh, the boys from Vulunitu. Will the boys from Maris? Yes. We will keep the goal. They're pointing to the uprights. Morris Brothers wanting to take first points in this match in the under 15 20 2015 finals. Now, see how, uh, how, how the QVS boys was just lying there. There was a uh, yes, it, it looks like a hand in the ruck. An, an unprofessional foul there uh, uh, by the boys from Vulini 2. As you can see, lining up for the kick is Osea Natonga of Maris Brothers High School. It up. Pull it to the uh, left hand corner of the post now QVS to kick it away from uh, their 22 line QVS with possession My Michael Longanindangondango to kick it away from their 22 line good passage of play being played here by both teams we've seen uh, uh, QVS attacking early in the match and now Marist gaining the possession Celestino allowing that ball to bounce. Now look at this boy with the ball. And again he showed it. And again he's taking this QVS defense uh, apart. Still with possession. Still Celestino with uh, possession. A very good passage of play there by Celestino. Now Marist. Yes, taken in up uh, by... Yes, Alivaretti very well of, of Marist Brothers High School. Jerome Nale. Still Marist with possession. 
Stand up, and that's a no on for Mars Brothers. Advantage being played here to the boys from Bulloni 2. Curious with possession. Madhu Rayala to clear it out from the truck. Yes, inside pass there to the hard running uh, forwards of Josiah Nakora of QVS. QVS with possession. Oh, that's uh, not backwards, rather, says the referee. Still QVS with possession. Madhu Rayala. Good, good ball taken up there by Amini Sitai Sowani of QVS, the inside center. Now, it put, passing the ball up to the Spista. And a good run here uh, uh, by Ratu. Yes, he is he's going all the way. And uh, Ratu, Gulli uh, Yasim, Balai Soma Soma of Queen Victoria School, has uh, registered the first try in this under 15 Dean's competition. Uh, that was a solo effort by uh, Ratu Gulli uh, Yasim, Balai Soma Soma of Queen Victoria School. You, you, you saw how he took the ball up. He's a very big uh, player. And. Uh, very talented. See how they, they 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 threw the pass to him. It was a solo effort. He took he, he took that uh, George Versonia away, and then see how Celestino trying to catch up with the, this gentleman, but was not able to push him out. But that was a solo effort by Ratu Kuliniasi, Bali Somo Somo, uh, registering the first try for QVS. Now we can see an uh, injured player out here on the field. It's not always a good sight to see. Yes, uh, as we can see on our screen, the try scorer, Ratu Kulinia Simbale Somo Somo of uh, QVS. Not able, not able to convert the try, Amini Sitai Sawani, but QVS. Leading Morris Brothers High School, five, five points to move. Oh, the referee is allowed. As we can see on the screen, the injured player. We we still trying to get a number. Uh, who's injured out here on the field? It's, as I said earlier, it's not always a good sign uh, uh, to see a player being injured in this uh, Coca-Cola Zero Deans competition. But uh, thankful to uh, uh, the medical team, uh, the team from Saint John. Uh, St. John always out here to lay a hand in attending uh, to these injuries. Yes, uh, we, uh, as we see that the, uh, the medical team pulling the young QVS player. Another kick at goal attempt by, uh, uh, by the center, who is the kicker today, Leweni Mode Vakatanga. Mode Vakanga, rather. Uh, but not able to convert that try, uh, to Kulinia Simbalei Somo Somo. He's pulled it out to the uh, left, uh, to the right hand and uh, upright. Corner. Injured player, some neck injury. As the, uh, the medical team uh, taking the injured player out. Play is still going on. Ball been taken up by the boys from QVS. QVS now with the momentum, setting the pace in this game. Putting the ball out wide, double up by Samuela. Now a look at the center, Lewenyu Modevaka. Good passage of play. As we see now, the boys from Bulin 2 controlling this game well. Pointing fingers are going on in this game. Leweni Mwale Wakanga pointing to his opposition. Look at the bench from QVS. Maris Brothers, Lino Vesuinandi to throw it into the line. And stolen there by a QVS, Kayava Kamanga. Clearing kick, downfield by Madhu Rayala. Might be too much. Yes, it is. Uh, it was a, it was a strong kick by uh, Matthew. They will bring it back, right to where he took the kick from. <laughs> QVS uh, leading Murray's Brothers High School, five points to nil. Now 
as we see the rain pouring down here at the ANZ National Stadium. Hasn't dampened the spirits of the supporters, coming, still coming out in numbers to support their players. Now, Maurice Brothers with possession, taken Philippe Raya, were taken down there in a the tackle. Still Maurice with possession. Now, as we see, say Monu Muri, the boy from Daku, in Tailevu. Jerome Nalet, dumping that ball down field. Taking play now, 10 meters away from from the QVS 22 line. Play now being taken inside QVS's half. As we await secure Turukawa and Delai to throw it into the line for QVS. Rain pouring heavily now at the ANZ National Stadium. Now stolen there by Morris Brothers High School. But there's a penalty uh, being awarded to QVS. He was crossing in the, uh, during the line out. Now uh, QVS with possession. Not a very good uh, clearing kick there. By Michael Longan in Dangdang. Only gained about five meters. Still uh, possession now with Queen Victoria School. You see on your screen the fullback for QVS. Maris Brothers with possession stolen there in the line out by the boys from Flagstaff. Kick there by Oceana Tango. Now taken in well by the boys from QVS. That was Ravoni Nadula, Naduva rather, who taken that ball. A kicking, uh, a clearing kick there by Samuel Atamani. No, not a good uh, take there by the boys from Flagstaff. It was uh, Paulo Toka who, who dropped that ball and who knocked that ball forward while he attempted to take that ball. Now lay inside the Maris brothers half as QVS with a good attacking opportunity here today. Look at the replay. He tried to take the ball, or he, or he was looking at the opposition coming in for the, for the kill, rather. But uh, he didn't focus on the ball, trying to pick it up. Resulted in a knock-on, now giving possession away to QVS. Another set piece there by QV Victoria School. There's a penalty now being awarded uh, to Maris, but oh, that's an early detachment from the scrum. Uh, I think it's by the number seven of uh, QVS. Now possession back to the boys from Flagstar. For those of you who've just joined us uh, this morning, uh, we're witnessing here the under 15 uh, uh, Dean's final competition, competition between uh, Murray's Brothers High School and QVS. QVS leading Murray's Brothers five points to nil. QVS again with possession. Taking play well, now taken up there by their prop Josea Nakora of Queen Victoria School. No one there to play half back. Counter rocking by the boys from Flagstaff. Uh, st still possession with QVS rather. Now QVS trying to spread that ball out wide. Taken up by Samuel Ray Ranadika. Still QVS with possession. Clearing out from Matthew, clearing out from Scrum. Again taken it up by Amini Sitai Sawani. Still QVS with possession, taken up there uh, by Solomon Kotabalavu. Matthew clearing that ball out, oh, not a really good pass there by Matthew. Is that a knock-on? Well, the, the referee was playing advantage for an offside play by the boys from Flagstaff. QVS with a, uh, a good, uh, in a good position to take a kick at goal. Uh, Marius Brothers being penalized for an offside play. Yes. QVS opting to kick for goal. Good passage of play being shown here by the boys from Vulini 2 controlling this game well. Look at that replay. Looking at the replay here, see how uh, the boys from Vulini 2, yes, they, the boys from are not retrieving back. They, they came up early in that uh, set place. The referee saw that well. Resulting in the penalty being awarded to QVS. We have to 
take the kick. Madiu Rayala, the halfback of QVS. And he, he pulled that out to the left. Still uh, 23 minutes gone in this game. Still QVS leading Marish Brothers High School five points to nil. Still waiting. Uh, oh, still waiting for Marius Brothers High School to clear it away from their 22. A, a block there by the boys, uh, QVS. And uh, yes, it looks like a knock-on. It is a knock-on by Marius Brothers High School. And uh, that was not a really good clearing kick there by uh, the boys from Marius, which now has resulted in a scrum down right in front of, uh, inside the uh, Marius Brothers 22. And 10 meters away from their try line, QVS, 23 minutes, 24 minutes rather, gone in this game. QVS still lead Marriott Brothers, five points to nil. Good attacking opportunity here by the boys from Vulunitu. As we can see, Madhu Rayala. You see, they go for a set piece. Madhu Rayala releasing it down to Samuela. Samuela go there, and a run up there by the fullback Michael. Good place. Now still Michael, they hold him up. The Marius Brothers uh, uh, teams hold him up, but QVS were able to put him down. Still possession with QVS. QVS still with possession. Attacking opportunity there, as we see Samuela taking that ball up. Still QVS with possession. Pick and drive. Yes, pick and drive there by Sakeo of Queen Victoria School. The boys from Vulini too. Maris Brothers defending their line. Ball being taken up there by Solomon Kotobalago of Queen Victoria School. QVS still with possession. Still continuing with the uh, pick and drive. They're gaining a meter every time the boys from Bulunitu taking the ball up. An inside pass. Good tackle there. Now still with possession is Amini Sitai Sawani. But the penalty being awarded to Maris. It looks like a sharpening being played. Yes, it is. Uh, the uh, boys from Blue 2 has been penalized when uh, Amini Sita Isawane tried to take that ball up. He stepped off his left foot and uh, there were players blocking a defensive line for Marius Brothers High School. That resulted in this penalty now taking play, uh, still inside Marius Brothers half, uh, taking play uh, 10 meters inside their half. Yes. Look at the replay here as we see Amini Sita Isawane going in. There was a tackle. Yes, uh, there was a blocking there by the locks of QVS. Samuel Ranadita. It was such, it was an unfortunate uh, incident by Samuela as he tried to retrieve to support his player. Fortunately, he was in front of him. Morris Brothers, Simone taking the ball in from the lineup. Clearing kick there by Jerome Nale. Well, taken well there by Michael. Well, the ball to bounce. Well, he is struggling. And he's still playing on. He thought that it was going to be a scrum. Well, the referee has called that for a scrum. It, it was a forward pass and the knock on. Yes, uh, so unfortunate there from Marvis Brothers High School. The ball not taken in well by Michael Long and Indaro of Queen Victoria School as he, as he allowed the ball to bounce, allowing the defensive line for Morris Brothers to gain up on him. They were able to win back possession, but unfortunately, that was a knock on by the boys from Flagstaff. Nevertheless, Morris Brothers High School still with a great attacking opportunity here inside QVS's house. from QVS. There was Polo Toka of Marius Brothers High School taking that ball up. Still Marius with possession. Now they're spreading it out. A QVS flanker, like Edwin Moe. Edwin, Edwin, Edwin Moe, rather, still with possession. Marius Brothers, Ali Veroti, Valley. 
second drive from the boys from Flagstar. Now spreading that ball out to Philip Marawal. Out to Seymoni Romemuri. Seymoni. That was the referee called here. Let's penalize the boys from TVS for not releasing in the tackle. Yes. Not the boys from TVS not releasing that play in the tackle. That delayed the attacking opportunity from the boys from Flagstar. My boys from uh, Maros Brothers High School with a good attacking opportunity. Let's see what the captain will say. Will they kick the goal? Looks like they will take a quick tap. Yes, they do take a quick tap. They pass it up to their big uh, uh, forwards, Oliver Kivari Valley. Now Maros still in possession. They being taken up there by Amelia Security Show. by Amini Sitae Sowani <laughs> on the big flank of Mars Brothers High School Alivereti Verevalu looked like he was trying to kick that ball and a good timing tackle uh, by Amini Sitae Sowani of Queen Victoria School not on by Mars Brothers High School it was a let off now to the boys from Vunitu look at this replay as uh, they spread it out right here oh yes he looked he looked like he wanted to kick that ball but a good tackle there by MC Taisawani. Yes, time's up here in the first half. Yes, they will kick it out by Michael. Taking the... Now we're breaking for half time. Both teams are running to the sets. QVS in this under 15 Coca Cola Zero Deans competition. QVS leading Morris Brothers High School for five points to nil. This program in this second half. By the end of 30 minutes, we should know who has lifted the under 15 Coca Cola Zero Deans 2015 rugby championship. Now we see the officials making their way back now onto the field. Second half to kick off. Juve are still leading five points to nil. And we see Michael Longanin Dangandango of Queen Victoria School to kick off. Second half uh, competition now starting here at the under 15. Uh, we call a zero deans competition it was a strong kick it it, it, was, it went too far rather uh, the kick there by michael they bring him play back uh, to the halfway line as uh, maris now with possession wet conditions here at the anz national stadium uh, heavy downpour of rain but it, uh, as i mentioned earlier hasn't dampened the spirit of the supporters they're still coming in in numbers to support their players uh, support their teammates, support their school as they still coming in. Now Maris with possession right on the halfway line. There was a knock on, yes, that's a knock on by uh, Simone Rovemuri of Maris Brothers High School. Uh, these wet conditions, uh, players have to be careful. There is currently a heavy downpour here at the NZ National Stadium. Possession now turned over to the boys from Bulini 2. Come right here on the halfway line. Now looking at the uh, progression throughout the competition uh, by these two teams. Uh, uh, the QVS team, they beat Nassim in the quarterfinals. They beat Natambua in the semifinals. And now they're making it their way uh, playing here at the finals at the NZ Stadium. Now Maris allowing the ball to bounce. A good take there uh, by QVS. Yes, it looks like the, uh, the, the center of uh, QVS. They went with uh, Mode Vakana Vaka of uh, QVS. The boys uh, from Maris Brothers, they, they uh, well, they took a nap rather. They allowed that ball to bounce. You do not allow the ball 
a rugby ball to bounce as it can bounce in every direction and it bounced in the hands of Lewenyu Mode Wakanga of Queen Victoria School Queen Vic QVS look at that replay uh, yeah, they allowed the ball to bounce and again it was Paulo Toko who allowed that ball to bounce uh, there was nothing that Celestino Ra, uh, Ravutaumanda of Mars Brothers can do as uh, Lewenyu Mode Wakanga out sprinted him to the try line and extended uh, uh, QVS's uh, lead 10 points to nil. Good passage of play. It's a good uh, starting passage of play by the boys from Bulini 2, setting the pace early in the second half. As now we await the try scorer, Lewenyu Mode Wakanga, to convert his own try. Well, uh, he missed uh, that conversion. It looked like it was going through, but it's weighed out to the right. Still QVS. 10 points to nil. Well, uh, the boys from Flagstaff have about 27 minutes to change this game around. We have Jerome Nelly kicking that ball down to the boys from Bulini 2. Again, a clearing kick downfield. And again, they see how the, uh, the, the, the attacking, defensing line from uh, the boys from Bulini And again, a mistake there uh, by Celestino Ravu, uh, Ravu Taumanda of Maris Brothers High School. He played well in the first half. He seems, like he, he seems like he's making a lot of mistakes in the second half, early in the second half. But is now taken play and given possession away to the boys from Vulini 2. QVS with a great attacking opportunity. 10 meters away from uh, Morris Brothers' uh, try line. See how the boys from QVS lining up for an attack. Madhu Rayala of Queen Victoria School. Passing it up to Samuela, to Waisea, of an inside pass there to the big winger, Ratu Kunia Simbalei Sumsomo. Still QVS with possession, now Samuela Tamani taking the ball up. Uh, again, oh, <laughs> good play there, as Waisea Sao Sao taking the ball up, unfortunately. He knocked that ball forward. Still uh, 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 a good opportunity here for QVS. But Maris Brothers with possession now, five meters away from their own try line. See how the pace has been set early in the second half. It's Jerome fitting it into that. Uh, um, not a very good clearing kick there by Felipe Maria of Maris Brothers High School. But nevertheless, uh, uh, still uh, play uh, uh, inside the Marist half, 10 meters away from their own try line. QVS now with a good uh, taking opportunity. Sakeo and Delay of QVS to throw it into the line. He, well, he overthrew that. Now giving possession back away to Marist Brothers High School. He can drive by the boys from Flagstaff, as we noticed. Uh, I mean, yes, the show taking that ball up. Again, same one, Rongo Muri of Maris Brothers. Jerome Nale, clearing it out. Clearing kick again from Felipe Mareawa of Maris Brothers High School. Still inside their half. QVS now with possession. Five meters away from Maris Brothers' 22 line. As we notice the, how the Marius Brothers uh, players progressed, pro, progressed rather, into this competition, reaching the final. They beat St. John at the Wadi in the quarterfinals, and they beat, uh, they beat RKS in the semifinals. And now they're meeting QVS here in the Coca-Cola Girardines under-15 final. Still Marius possession. I mean, I mean, yes, sure, but a knock-on there. 
by Marius Brothers High School. They've given possession away back to QVS. QVS still uh, with a good attacking plat uh, opportunity here inside Marius Brothers High. Crowds and supporters still uh, making their way into the National Stadium here at uh, Lodala. Now the boys from Vulitu. Good time now they're spreading that ball out wide. Michael, and, and again to that big man, uh, the, the uh, try scorer Ratu uh, Kulinyasi, but he was taken out of play. Uh, as we see uh, QVS trying to spread that ball out wide to uh, their big man. Well, a penalty has been awarded. Has a penalty been awarded to Marius Brothers High School? Well, we can see that somebody's been yellow carded here. Well, there's a yellow card here. And it's a try scorer who's been yellow carded. The speedster for QVS, Ratu Kulinia Simbali Somosomo, the try scorer in the first half has been yellow carded. We yet to see what was the uh, what was the reason for his yellow card in the second half. But nevertheless, now as we can uh, we're looking at the replays. Well they're spreading it wide. Now you can see Ratu uh, Kuliniasi is taking that ball up. Oh, well, well, we're back into the live match. Nevertheless, QVS uh, now playing with 14 men on the field. QVS with possession. Uh, and up another kick now by Samuel Atamani. Again allowing it to bounce. But now covered well uh, there by Paula Toka of Marriott Brothers High School. Some changes coming into the field. As we see, uh, yes, Numaya Silani of QVS making his way onto the field. And also Sean Mudunubitu. A rare mistake there by Michael Olongan in Dangundangon. Knocking that ball forward. Very slippery conditions here in uh, the ANZ Stadium. Very wet conditions. Now Marius Brothers High School with possession. Jerome Nale. Up to Felipe. Oceano Toma kicking it downfield. Taken in well there by QVS. Well, not a really good kick there uh, by Matthew Real. As he tried to kick that ball downfield. But he missed it. It was, uh, uh, was a, uh, a miss there by Matthew. Morris Brothers now with possession. This is a good... Uh, uh, a taking opportunity as the boys from Vulitu are playing with 14 men. As we just recently saw the, uh, uh, their, their speed star, their winger, the first try scorer, Ratu Kulinyasi, Balei Somosomo, uh, recently being yellow carded for an offense. Now Maris Brothers with possession. Okay, the ball up again, now it's Celestino. Passed it out right to his winger, Polotoka. Polotoka still with possession, taking the QVS defense on. Now Marius Brothers to possession. Jerome uh, giving that ball out wide. Now look, hooking up to the forwards. Again they spread it out wide. Still Marius with possession. The forwards are uh, taking a, a run up. As we see Selwyn Cassidy taking the ball. A good defensive tackle there uh, by Michael Longanindango of QVS. But still as we see now Simone, Simone Rogoyomuri. The younger brother of Josur Rogoyomuri who will feature in the under 18 a competition this afternoon. Still Marius Brothers with, with uh, possession. Now uh, the Celestino. Celestino now. Look at this boy run. Now still uh, and again the ball possession now. Taken in there by Aminiasi. But a knock on 
by the boys from Flagstaff. What a wasted opportunity there. They, they look well in the attack, but it's, it's, it's these kind of mistakes that are, are costing them uh, uh, possession here in this game. Still QVS leading Marish Brothers High School 10 points to nil. Look at the replay. Look at this boy Celestino. See how he beats off and pushes off the defenders. But uh, the uh, Aminia Sitiri show was not able to hold on to that ball as he took the QVS defense on. Now QVS with possession. They're playing with 14 men. From our viewers uh, watching uh, this game this afternoon, we noticed that uh, there's no pushing in this uh, game in the under 14 and under 15 category. No pushing in the scrum. So possession now with QVS. Matthew. Rearing kick there by Samuel Atamani of QVS. They now five meters away from their 22 line. Possession now to Maris Brothers High School. We await Lu Lino Vasuinandi to throw it into the line for Maris Brothers. Lino to throw it into the line. Very scrappy play there in the lineup, but nevertheless, Marius with possession. Well, that was a, a knock on, a slight knock on by uh, uh, Marius Brothers High School. Giving possession away to the boys from Vulini 2. Seems like nothing is going on well uh, for the boys from Flagstaff. Now QVS with possession. As we await Matthew Rayala to fit it into the scrum. Samuela, Samuela boy, taking the defense of a kick downfield uh, by Samuela Tamani. Now Maris, as we see Celestino. Uh, uh, that's a penalty now being awarded to Queen Victoria School. They're looking to take it quickly. And yes, they take it quickly. The halfback for uh, uh, Matthew now taking the ball, passing it out to Michael. Well... Uh, Again, advantage was being played by the referee. The boys from Maris Brothers High School not retrieving back then. There was a very clever play there by Madhu Rayala of Queen Victoria School. He found the boys from Maris Brothers in an offside position. He found them napping and uh, did a quick tap and allowing them um, to gain an additional 10 meters, giving their kicker the opportunity to extend their lead in this game. Lewendi Modebakanga lining up to take this kick for QVS. For viewers joining us here in this uh, pay per view uh, live match here at the ANZ Stadium. This competition has been going on for about 76 years and uh, it's amazing that it still has that hype here in the Fiji Secondary School competition. As we are witnessing uh, QVS, yes, uh, he was able to raise those flags, Lewenni Modebakanga was able to raise those flags, extending uh, QVS's uh, lead by 13 points to nil. Marius Brothers still yet to uh, uh, still yet to get some points in this match. Now we see the speed stuff for uh, uh, Queen Victoria School Ratukuni Miyasim Balei Somosomo making his way, as you see him on the screen, making his way back onto the field. Yes, the referee is call, calling him up. Now QVS uh, playing again with 15 men. Still don't write these uh, boys from Flagstaff out as uh, they still have a lot of time to play. Now ball taken up by Celestino. Celestino again 
Look at this boy. He's beating his previous defenders and a fell off, but unfortunately, knocked that ball forward. Now, possession with the QVS. Counter racking there by the boys from Flagstaff. But the referee says no. We'll call it back from for a knock on by Celestino Ravu Taumanda of Murray's Brothers High School. Well, the touch judge having a word to the referee. Seems like the touch judge had picked up uh, an incident. And what the previous players. Going up to flanker, and the Solomon of Katabalavo is still before the school. For a high tackle. High tackle onto Celestino Ravutomanda of Maris Brothers High School. As we uh, await to look at the high shot, yes, now look at this boy, Celestino. Uh, and, and a high tackle uh, by Solomon Kotambalavu of QVS. Uh, yes, uh, he that was taken high uh, by Solomon. He's lucky to still remain onto the field from that high tackle, but nevertheless, Maris Brothers High School still with possession inside QVS. Half. Not taken in well there in the lineup by Bryce Pickering. Still QVS with possession. Hearing kick there by Madhu Rayala. Again, uh, Celestino, look at his boy run. Still in possession. Now taking it up. Marzban to the speedster. Paulo Toka. Again, a knock on there by uh, Paulo Toka. Not able to hold on to possession, uh, this boy is from Maris. Clearing kick. Celestino rushing back to take that ball. Again, Paulo Toka. Boys from QVS trying to hold them up. They've stolen uh, possession. Possession now is in the, has turned over to QVS. Mario spreading it out wide. Big dancing feet there by Samuel Atamani. Still QVS with possession. Looks like... Yes, that was holding on. Yeah, they were holding on in that... Uh, the, the, the boys from Marish Brothers High School were on their feet. And a quick tap here uh, by, by Osea Natonga of Marish Brothers High School. Still Maris with possession. Play now taken inside QBS's half. Giving it up to their big boys. Bryce Pickering taking that ball up. Pick and drive now by Simone Romo Muri of Maris Brothers High School. Still Maris with possession. Passing it up. Not taken in well. There's knock on by Salis Kimo. Uh, again, uh, uh, very silly mistakes uh, being uh, knock ones and, and poor passes by uh, the boys from Flagstaff. Uh, they're turning over possession back to the boys from uh, Volini 2. Look at the replay as they, uh, as Salisbury tried to uh, come up. Well, it was not, uh, uh, to, to be fair, it wasn't a good pass there uh, by Felipe Marayawa onto Salestino. He was not able to take the ball. QVS uh, with possession right onto the halfway line. Still QVS leading Marius Brothers High School, 13 points to nil. Again with that set piece by QVS. Putting the ball up to the steering kick there by Madhu Rayala. Taken in well there by the boys from Flagstaff. Still Marius Brothers with possession. Kick down field by Felipe Marreal. No, again, not taking him well by uh, Michael Long and Dangdang of QVS. Marius Brothers, uh, as we take a look at the bench for Marius Brothers, they are more worried as they are running out of time and uh, they, they would require two converted tries to, to grab this win away from QVS, but at the moment, it's it's mistake after mistake that's uh, that's uh, delaying them uh, that opportunity and allowing QVS to to uh, defend their line. Still, QVS leading 13 points to nil. Taken in back there uh, 
Hey, most brothers, now they're spreading the ball again. Now to Solospino. A good step there, Solospino. Great tackle and defensive but tackles here by the boys from Bully 2. They're defending their line. And still Maris Brothers with possession. Ball being taken up there by Amnes Sikirishaw. Still Maris. Here comes the replacement player, Shane Fuatau of Maris Brothers High School. Advantage being played by the referee. Ball being taken up uh, by Alberetti Vere Valu. Yes, the referee was playing advantage. He calls them back. To award the, the penalty. Again, a quick tap there uh, by Maris Brothers High School. That was Oceana Tonga taking that ball up. They are meters away from uh, QVS Australia. Pick and drive by the boys from Flagstaff. They are hungry for a try here. And uh, it looks like this. it is a try. It is a try by Maris Brothers High School. Uh, it looks like, well, uh, look at the supporters. They are overwhelmed. It took them uh, about. Uh, 45 minutes uh, to register points in this game and they scored the try we'll, we yet to confirm who has scored the try from Marius Brothers High School but now has taken uh, 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 has registered points for Marius Brothers in this game Good, uh, now we look at the replay. See the quick tap here uh, by Oceana Tonga. He took the defense on. He gained meters. See how that they were not that far away from uh, the QBS uh, try line. And again, he pick and drive from the boys uh, from Maris. Look at how uh, uh, the pick and drive, they, 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 uh, they were so confident that they were able uh, to, to support each other in scoring that try by the forwards of Maris Brothers High School. Romelu Vueti. That was the better goal on Dubu Watomba. Not able to convert that try. Still uh, QBS leading Maris Brothers High School at 13 points to 5. converted the try by Maris Brothers High School is still not enough. They'll need to register extra points and they're running out of time. Here kick there by Petro and Tomba. Taken there by the try scorer. Now uh, as you see the try scorer Ratu Kulunia Simbale Somosomo of Queen Victoria School taking that ball up. Still QVS with possession. Oh belly big picked up there by Samuel Tamani. Still QVS with possession, they're spreading that ball out wide. Michael uh, uh, Longainin Dangandango keeping that ball, but it went out on the full. Now possession being taken back to the boys from Marius Brothers High School. Five meters away from the halfway line, inside Marius Brothers uh, half. Lino Vasuinandi. To throw it into the line for Maris Brothers High School. We have about five minutes to go in this match. Stolen there by the boys from Bully 2. QVS still with possession inside uh, Maris Brothers half. See Madhu now spreading it up. Taking it up uh, there uh, by Ravoni Nagula, the captain uh, for QVS, but not on. Again uh, from the boys from uh, QVS giving possession away back to the boys from uh, Murray's Brothers High School. There's a player down there, the hooker for QVS, Sakir Tirukawa Ndelai, being attended to by the medical team. As we can see, still crowds. Uh, making their way onto the ANZ Stadium. You look at the um, embankment there on the far end. It's, it's starting to uh, uh, pick up. Crowds are starting to come in. You can see umbrellas, uh, 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 umbrellas, a lot of umbrellas here onto uh, the embankment area. As uh, fans and supporters are braving the rain, braving the wet weather. Here to support their team. 
Now playing in halfback, George Vesoni of Marcus Brothers High School. Again, uh, again, not a very good play there by the boys from Flagstaff, but uh, an, a, a penalty now being awarded uh, to the boys from QVS. We see what QVS will, uh, I think, uh, oh, they've opted to kick for goal. Well, uh, they opted to kick for goal. It's about distance. Uh, is about roughly a little more than 30 meters away from the uprights. Yes, wanting to slow down the clock and extend their lead in this match. Most of the second half, uh, QVS has been controlling this game, mostly in the second half. They came in firing in the second half as we now await Leweni Modi Makanga of Queen Victoria School to extend their lead in this match. He struck that well. He has the distance. He has the direction. Yes, those legs are up. That extends uh, QVS's lead uh, 16 uh, to 5. Well, uh, we can now say that that is beyond the reach now for the boys from Marish Brothers High School. QVS, as we've just recently witnessed, Lewenim Modi Makanga of Queen Victoria School extending their lead in this match. 16. Now QVS leads uh, Marish Brothers High School 16 points to 5. Knock on there by the boys from Marish Brothers High School. Advantage being played here by the referee. Still uh, QVS with possession. Hearing kick downfield uh, by Madiu Rayala of Queen Victoria School. Taken in at the back there by Celestino. Again, Celestino trying to create movement for his team. Ball being taken up by George Vesoni of Maris Brothers High School. Again, uh, Celestino. Look at this boy go. And yes, he's, he's inspiring his team uh, to go on the attack. Still, Maris Brothers High School on the attack. Pick up there uh, by Aliberetti Verevalu of Marish Brothers High School. Not taken in well there by Petro. But advantage was being played by the referee. A quick tap again uh, this, uh, by Osenaton. Osenaton are still with possession. Look at this boy run. He plugs the ball out wide. And, 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 and yes, that is uh, Sandy Masuki, the replacement player, coming onto the field and uh, scoring a try for Marish Brothers High School. Well, uh, we see the boys from Flagstaff fighting back, trying to win this game. And I, I might be proven wrong here by earlier predicting QBS winning this game and extending their lead, but no, Marish Brothers High School uh, is coming back uh, to, uh, to try and steal this win away uh, from uh, QVS. As we see, there uh, was a good a quick tap there by Oceano Tonga. Look at Oceano Tonga here. He had a quick tap. He stepped off his left foot and he ran through the defensive line of Queen Victoria School and he spread that ball out wide. Yes, uh, to his supporting player, Semi Rosuki, the replacement player who came in onto this field to try, who scored that try from Murray's Brothers High School. Well, uh, you see Celestino trying to come Well, uh, that was uh, pulled out towards the right of the uh, upright post. Still, uh, QVS leading Marius Brothers in this match 16 points to nil. 16 points to 10, sorry. QVS now. Marius Brothers High School. Well, uh, a good take there uh, by Samuel Atamani. QVS, yes, that's the end of the game. But QVS, they, all they need is just kick that ball out. And, well, they're trying to kick that ball out. And, uh, yes. Uh, <laughs> QVS. It looks like QVS. Yes, it is. They have won this match in the 2015 Coca-Cola Zero Deals competition. 
the the trophy heads down to Mulinitu to the boys of Queen Victoria School. We look at the supporters; they are very happy here at the ANZ National Stadium. QVS has uh, won uh, this competition, beating uh, Maris Brothers High School 16.